Okay, so today I'm going to show you guys how to make a proper RPG system. Okay, now I'm going to take down the old RPG system video. That was just a band aid on the problem because I had no idea how to get this thing working. We did all the updates recently. There's actually a proper way to do it now. So let's get started. Okay, first things first. Proxy, all killed. Integer. To zero, I've already got it set. I'm going to minus. About 10. That's set to 100. Unchanged. We're going to bring out. Integer compare. Make sure it's tested so this way it'll activate. And we're going to use the same one, digit zero. And we'll leave that at zero because oops. this is going to count down from 100 to zero, which is why this is minus. Okay? When this reaches zero, it'll activate. Equals. integer 1. I already created this earlier, by the way. I'm just double-checking everything. Add. This is set to 1. And this will increase it by 1. On change. Set. Okay. I'll show you how to do that. But next, we got to go here and create a number. I already got one set up. Number two. Multiply. I've already got this set up to 150. You need to roll the multiply and set this to 1.5. Okay. You can set this up any way you want, by the way. I'm just showing you how to do it. So now this will multiply 1.5 times every time we use it. Okay? We go here. Change the variable number two. Okay. Now what will happen? This is set to 150. So what happens is that when this activates this, it'll set this to 150. After that, it'll multiply it by 1.5. Okay. And that should be it. Am I correctly? Yeah, that should be it. Okay. Spawn. Start. Then it's changed to 10. So let me spawn in more often. At the 5. At the 5. Okay. Also, we're going to put our heads up display. I'm going to make this one. Variable and yeah, we're gonna make this our level. Actually, let's make it our, our experience. EXP. Okay. Select like that variable. This is going to be zero. This one's gonna be our level. This one's going to be integer two. An integer one, sorry. And zero, and that's a one. Okay. Now we start. This should work. Okay, now watch as the experience goes down, and watch how my level goes up, and now it changes. So 
Am I 150 now? Well, you get the point. So, yeah, that's how you get that to work. All right, so there you go. That's how you get the experience bar to work. All right? But now we got to make it do something. Okay. So next, we have to do this. We need to create another member. I already got one created. Number three. Multiply. Now this I can set to one, and that's a hundred. Okay. There's a reason why you want to do it this way. We go here, and we set this to. I guess one point five. That should work. Here's what you got to do. Yes, I tried a bunch of other ways of doing this. Nothing worked except this so far. Repeater. Repeat indefinitely. Unsignaled. Layer proxy. Modified properties. Health. Swap it out for number three. And okay. And that should do it. Now you have to use a repeater because I tried using this to activate this and it wouldn't do it. Tried this too, wouldn't do it. So I'm using a repeater for this. So now watch what happens when I level up a little bit. closely. Keep an eye on my health meter. Again, I'm at 225 now.
All right, you get the picture. That's how you get that to work. And you do that for health, armor, damage, speed, whatever you want to use it for. So, yes, that's how you get that to work and how you get it to work properly. <clears throat> now, refilling your health. You got me there. Um, I've tried everything. I've tried to connect these to these some way. Nothing works. Uh, they get to refill your health. So, that's the only dilemma you're dealing with here. <clears throat> but, hey, if you can figure out some way to get that to work, go for it. And that is how you get a proper level up system. Um, I want to thank everyone for their patience through all the other ones I had to build. Hopefully uh, this will help solve the problem permanently for you guys. Until then, you all take care.